drumstick on Twitter and on YouTube and on Tumblr. Go follow her. She's amazing. But um, the way to say I love CC in Japanese would happen to be Watashi wa Christian Koma ga daisuki which means I love for, uh, Christian Koma. <laughs> or if you want to do it, the I love CC bit goes Watashi wa Shishi ga daisuki it's not CC, it's she, she, which oddly enough means death, death, in a way. So you'd be like, oh, death, death. I love death, death. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. So let me just uh, ask if I was from Japan. I have to say no, I'm not. I'm, I wish I was. <laughs> okay, I'm replying back right now, Sam. Uh, but, um, I'll be teaching you how to say happy birthday, how you like something, or how someone likes something, and whatnot. And, um, also writing. I'll teach you how to write some of the stuff in Japanese and whatnot, and probably some names. I'll take requests probably after this and be like, oh, this is how you would write your name in Japanese and everything. And, well, yeah. I'm going to do one with, um, Liz from CC's drumstick and whatnot real quick because her name is actually, would be really easy for me. Her name would be pronounced Z's. Uh, because in Japan they don't have any L's and whatnot, and yeah, it's weird. So their L's are pronounced like R's and everything. Um, let me see if I can remember. It goes Rari Rure Ro for the whole entire R's, and then you got like the small like Su and whatnot, which slunks up like the whole entire writing. But um you'll be looking at paper for now. Okay. Paper. It's blank. There's nothing. And I'm my background's gonna be Twitter for this. I don't know. Uh the top. But yeah. You the it goes re and then su and I'll show you. That's re. This is re. So, so you know, I'm, I'll write the romaji on the top and then on the side and like over the cut. This is katakana. It's used for foreign words or to be, uh, it's used for foreign words, sound, like sound words and whatnot. Like, if you don't know necessarily how to say something, you can use it for the sound necessarily. And it's also used to make, like, a big statement. So, like, if you're shouting in Japanese, they would use um, katakana. It's like when you're typing, you just put on caps lock, and you just write everything out in giant capital letters. So, yeah. That's re, and then this is su. Like, Superman, su, and whatnot. Ah, let me stand the paper up. Risu. That's how you say this. Who happens to be CC Strumstick? Yeah, I'm on my Twitter while I'm doing this because I'm multitasking. Alright, fair enough. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. I don't feel like I might later get some stuff, but yeah. 
um, you probably can't see it because it's in pencil. Oh, maybe you can. I don't know. So, uh, okay. Backdrop. You can see my, what I'm, yeah, that's not great or anything. Um, this is for Christian Coma. I have one in, that I did in calligraphy and everything. I'll just cap that for now. But, uh, it says, that's the kanji for I, which is Watashi. This is actually, um, in hiragana ha, but it's also, uh, it's a relational type thing. Like, we have our own version of relational, but it's, I don't feel like getting into the whole English relational and whatnot, but here it's translated into wa instead. So it's watashi wa ku. This is ku. I don't, if I had a pencil, I'd write above it, but I don't. So that's ku. That's ri again. This is a combination. You know how I was telling you about the small, like, su and whatnot? That's what this is for. It's a small ya, with, it, combined with chi, which translates into blood. And you add the ya, it means cha. And then you got n. This is the n, n sound. You have to be careful when writing n. It's complex. It's like check mark, then slash, little dot thing. Then the dot in the center right here separates names. That's what it's what I was told. And then this like half box is ko, and this is ma. So koma. So completely from this part to here to the ma me watashi wa Christian koma. And then this right here is here kana ga. It's ka with the ten tens, which Trent makes it into a ga, and ten tens main, means dot dot. And then, this is ta, with the ten tens, making it da. This is I, the e, dai. It's like an I, it's like a I when you write it out. It's d-a-i. And then, this right here, this part, it's just the kanji for su. It's weird. It's like, why have a complex kanji for su? But it is. And we were taught in the, uh, in the Tokyo dialect, so the u is normally silent when you're saying it, when, I'm, when I actually say this too. And this is ki. And then this is de. It's te with, two ten te with the ten tones. And then, then you got de. Uh, Su. Su, which would be right here also if I was to write it out, is silent. The U part is silent, so you're like hit, like a slight hiss, I guess you can say, but here. Okay. Watashi wa Christian koma ga daisuki desu. See, it's like a hiss. It's, it's not really used a lot, but, huh? It depends on where you go, is like how they pronounce it. Ah, jinx. So out on paper. So, um, jinx drawing. Let's go to something complex. Well, not really. Okay. Yeah, you can tell this is all black rail brides whatnot. I normally do lots of black rail brides related stuff. Okay. It goes, Watashi wa jinxu to semi. Sami doru ga daisuki desu, which means I love jinx and sami dao. Okay, the to is like an and. It, it's another relational. It joins, like if you're making a list, like how we have our commas, that's what you do for linking everything. So, I love jinx and sami dao. And this is how you write sami dao. Sa mi do it's a toe with ten tens for do. And then, of course, daisuki does. Um, this is calligraphy. Mind you, my calligraphy is not that great, but this is what uh, Christian Coma, like I love Christian Coma, will look like in calligraphy. 
Quiverfy is an art style and everything. You just use a brush, and you have like an ink well, and whatnot. It's a special type of ink, the stains. It stains you, so be careful. Don't get it on you. It stains your clothes like a motherfucker. But, um, you use the brush. There's many different brushes you can use. I can't necessarily, I can't, I can't remember which brush I used. But I went and wrote Watashi wa Christian Koma da Daisuke. Okay. Uh, bruh. This one. Some of you might hate, some of you might like, depends on who you are and who you're a fan of in this pairing and blah blah blah. I don't really care. If you whine and bitch about it, fucking gonna delete your comment or whatever, because I don't want trolls right now. It, okay, Watashi Wa, which is a common basic of I and everything. And then this is Jake. J. This is how you, because it's like she with a ten tens on the top, which makes a G, and this is an e, a tiny E, so it makes J, and this is E, J, K, and then get K, and then of course the dot in the center to be separated, and then you got P, and then small Su, which ma gives it a clip sound, so it's not. Pitsu. It's Pitsu. And then a larger Su. Pitsu. So, I, I gave this more, I don't know if I did this one right, everything, but to me when I say Ella, because the t two L's, it gives it more of a clip sound. And that happens to be Ra, Eh, uh, Small Su, Ra, Era, Koru, Ga Daisuke Das. Translation, I love Jake Fitz and Ella Cole. So, yeah. That's how you go about that. And, there. End of the BBB montage. Yes. BBB. 666 hit. Blah ha ha. But, um. Yeah. Hope you enjoy. I'll probably make another one later and everything and blah blah blah. Okay. But anyways. Bye bye. Hope you enjoyed my retarded mini Japanese video or whatnot. And everything. I'll teach you more later. Um and I'll teach you more on writing probably later. So bye bye.